So I wanted to make this video. Uh, I just watched one of Guitar Fingers. Uh, he gets everything. Everything Durkee does. And Gobbler, I swear. Especially Durkee, he, he gets everything. And I love it. But a lot of times I don't get to catch up with like what Durkee says and stuff. But I just watched it. That boy has lost his everlasting mind. And if he doesn't stop saying riddle me this, I'm gonna drive to Boone County with a cop copy of Batman from like the 90s and slap him in the face with it because I am so sick of hearing him say riddle, riddle me that. It, it, he's just, oh my God, dude, he's, he's so cringe to watch anymore. It's just awful. And another thing, it's funny. You say when your mom gets mad at the family, all she, like she always runs her mouth. Do you think she was running her mouth about Jessica? I don't believe Jessica would do anything like that, bro. I don't know him personally, but like I'm a big fan of his and stuff. And I know he's got his dark side and he's got his good side. But man, I guarantee you that dude didn't have to need for any women. They were probably throwing themselves at him, bro. So you need to shut up about that. And we found out the truth. We found out that your mom's not a white. That came out of her own mouth too. So what is it a lie or is it the truth? You know, you always say your mom, you know, she, she says a bunch of stuff when she gets mad. So what is it? Is it a lie or is it truth? And you get really triggered when somebody touches on you being a white, a castle, or you, you always like to, to pull out things like you got money, you got this, you got that. Well, let me ask you this. The guy said something about him having a, a jersey, a, a Green Bay jersey. You ran to your room tripping over pop cans and dead dogs and shit because your house is disgusting and filthy. And to just to pull that far of jersey off the, the hanger. Why don't you do that shit when people say you lie about your cards, like your Babe Ruth or your Mickey Mantles? Why don't you have that same energy running to your safe or your bedroom? You know why? Because you're a liar. You've never told the truth since you've been on YouTube. Everything you say is a lie. And we all know that because you're a liar. Durkee, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tell you this. You have to get off the drugs, dude. You really do. Because you look awful, dude. That page boy haircut you got with the, you covering up the bald spot that you said was a, a, a wound from when you got jumped. You didn't get jumped, dude. You've never been in a fight. You haven't came out of the trailer in 47 years, even though you're 35. You're, you're just a liar, man. You need to go get help. For, really. You really need help, man. You need to just tell your mom, say, Mom, all the cigarette money, all the drug money, all, my sh all the shoes you buy me, the guns, Chig, the four-wheelers, just put that toward my recovery and I'll go for 30, 60, 90 days. Because you really do. I believe if you would get clean and you would rewatch these videos that you put out, you would be embarrassed. Really. And I hate to say this, man, but the, the people in your lives, bro, they are all trolls. You know that, right? Three of the people that you can fight in, I know for a fact are trolls. For real. So you just need to clean it up, man. For real. And the uh, incident with the, the suboxone strips, like maybe if you wouldn't have freaked out so bad, people wouldn't have noticed. But since you tripped out, everyone and their dog had to, you know, slow, slow it down to see what was in there. You are not smart. You are the dumbest individual. Like I would love to meet you just to see how dumb you really are. And when you try to say big words, you don't even say them right, bro. In order, like when you say a word, please look it up and see what the meaning is before you say it, because you sound silly. <coughs> but that's all I really got, guys. Um, he really does need to go to rehab because he's he's literally withering away. Like if you watch his videos from like months, you know, before, like he would gain a little weight, he get small again, but he literally looks like like a, a tablecloth thrown over a skeleton that's what he looks like he looks horrible 
All right, guys, uh, have a good one. For all you guys that are working, be careful, you know, get home to the family. Durky, get out and get a job. You're a liar, you don't have a job. Just go get a job at a convenience store, man. Get a, Just get a job. Be a man for one time in your life and get a job and maybe kick in and help your mom and chick. All right, guys, have a good one.